So think about the human being. What's what's important for our blood? It requires oxygen. So we have so much of our vascular system that moves over our lungs because it's required to have that exchange. We have to put fresh oxygen into the blood, make the blood fresh. Not only is it going to be created like in the heart itself, but you have to constantly feed and fuel that blood to give it what's necessary for our own survival so it can uh, essentially cleanse itself. Right. And blood moves to the end of your extremities and your hands might get cold, but there's a differential between the hot and the cold, creating a natural movement within the body itself, a very efficient vortex-based movement throughout our veins. But it's the same characteristics that are also shared in water itself. So your blood is not actually pushed through your body. The heart pumps, right, to get the initial start going. Things require a catalyst. Yes. But the rest of the body, it's actually pulled through. Mm, Because of the design and the way it's actually moving, this viscous, this Mm -hmm. fluid, it's pulled forward. Not pushed, but pulled. Not pushed forward. That's very important. And the aspect of this is one that Victor had seen with water and how uh, salmon or trout moved through it. Mm -hmm. And that was a huge principle of design to realize that nature in this power carries essentially this same movement 